Hello, and welcome to our channel. In today's video, we are going to tell you about F-117 Nighthawk, world's first fighter build with stealth technology. Documentary. We will give you an exclusive look at the technology used for this aircraft. You will learn about the challenges, secrets, and surprises that surrounded this revolutionary jet. The F-117 Nighthawk was a game changer in the history of aviation and warfare, and you will not want to miss any of the details. So sit back, relax, and enjoy this incredible journey into the world of the F-117 Nighthawk. History The F-117 Nighthawk was developed by Lockheed's Secretive Skump Works Division in the late 1970s and early 1980s in response to the urgent need for a jet fighter that could evade enemy radar systems. The project was inspired by the work of a Soviet mathematician named Pyotr Ufintsev, who published a paper in 1962 that showed how the shape of an object affects its radar reflection. Lockheed engineers used Ufintsev's theory to design a faceted aircraft that would scatter radar waves in different directions, making it nearly invisible to radar. The first prototype of the F-117, codenamed Have Blue, flew in 1977 at the secret Groom Lake test site in Nevada. The aircraft proved the concept of stealth technology, but also faced many challenges, such as aerodynamic instability, engine reliability, and maintenance issues. Two prototypes were built, but both crashed during testing. Despite the setbacks, the Air Force decided to proceed with the development of the F-117 and awarded Lockheed a contract in 1978, a total of five pre-production aircraft, designated f 117 a were built and tested at Tonopah Test Range Airport, also in Nevada. The first flight of the f 117 a took place in 1981, just 31 months after the contract award. The aircraft achieved initial operational capability in 1983, but was kept under the strictest of secrecy for many years. It was not until 1988 that the program was publicly acknowledged and not until 1990 that it made its first formal public appearance. The F-117 was officially named Nighthawk, but was also commonly referred to as the Stealth Fighter, even though it was strictly an attack aircraft. The F-117 Nighthawk featured a distinctive angular design, black paint, and lacked afterburners for reduced infrared visibility. Powered by two General Electric F-404 turbofan engines, it reached a subsonic speed of 600 miles per hour. The stealth fighter carried no external weapons, maintaining its profile, and housed two laser-guided bombs internally, operated by the 4,450th Tactical Group. Later the 37th Tactical Fighter Wing, it was designed for precise, stealthy strikes in enemy territory. Pilots, chosen from elite ranks, underwent rigorous training and wore special gear, adopting call signs like Bandit, the fleet comprised 64 aircraft, with the last production F-117 delivered in 1990. Features The F-117 Nighthawk was the first operational aircraft to be designed with stealth technology, which gave it a significant advantage over conventional aircraft. Stealth technology is the art of making an aircraft invisible or undetectable to enemy sensors, such as radar, infrared, or acoustic. Stealth technology involves various aspects, such as shape, material, coating, and emission control. The F-117's shape was the most obvious feature of its stealth design. The aircraft was made of flat faceted surfaces, which reflected radar waves in different directions, rather than back to the source. The F-117 had a very low radar cross-section, or RCS, which is a measure of how much an object reflects radar waves. The F-117's RCS was estimated to be about 0, 0,001 square meters, or about the size of a ball bearing. By comparison, a typical fighter jet has an RCS of about 5 square meters, or about the size of a car. The F-117's material and coating also contributed to its stealth. The aircraft was made of aluminum and titanium alloys, which were covered with a special radar absorbent material, or RAM. The RAM was a composite of carbon fibers, iron and ferrite, which absorbed and dissipated radar waves, rather than reflecting them. The RAM also had a matte black color, which reduced the aircraft's visibility in the dark. 
The F-117's coating also had to be maintained and repaired regularly to ensure its effectiveness. The F-117's emission control was another aspect of its stealth. The aircraft had to minimize its infrared, or heat, signature, which could be detected by enemy sensors. The F-117 had two non-circular tailpipes, which mixed the hot exhaust with the cool ambient air, creating a flat diamond-shaped plume. The F-117 also had no afterburners, which would have increased its heat and noise. The F-117 also had to reduce its radio and electronic emissions, which could be intercepted by enemy signals intelligence. The F-117 used low probability of intercept, or LBI, radars and communications, which were hard to detect and jam. The F-117 also used passive sensors, such as thermal imaging and laser designator, which did not emit any signals. The F-117's stealth technology was not perfect, however. The aircraft was still vulnerable to some types of radar, such as low-frequency or bistatic radar, which could exploit the gaps or edges of the aircraft's shape. The aircraft was also more detectable when it opened its bomb bay or when it flew in bad weather, which could create radar reflections. The aircraft was also limited by its subsonic speed, its short range, and its small payload. The aircraft also required extensive maintenance and support, which increased its cost and complexity. Achievements The F-117 Nighthawk was a remarkable achievement of engineering and innovation, and proved its worth in several combat operations. The F-117's first combat mission was flown during the United States' invasion of Panama in 1989, where it attacked a military command center. The F-117's most famous role was in the Gulf War of 1991, where it flew over 1,300 sorties and scored direct hits on over 1,600 high-value targets in Iraq, such as command and control centers, airfields, bridges, and bunkers. The F-117 was the only aircraft that was allowed to strike targets in downtown Baghdad, where the air defenses were the most dense and lethal. The F-117 was so effective and feared that it was nicknamed the Wobbling Goblin by the Iraqis. The F-117 also participated in other conflicts, such as the NATO intervention in Bosnia and Herzegovina in 1994 and 1995, where it attacked Serbian air defenses and military facilities. The F-117 also took part in the NATO air campaign in Kosovo in 1999, where it attacked Serbian targets and infrastructure. The F-117 Nighthawk was a groundbreaking aircraft that revolutionized aerial warfare with its stealth technology. It was the first of its kind and paved the way for the development of other stealth aircraft, such as the B-2 Spirit, the F-22 Raptor, and the F-35 Lightning II. The F-117 was also a testament to the ingenuity and creativity of the Skunk Works team and the courage and skill of the Nighthawk pilots. The F-117 was a legend in the sky and a symbol of American air power. Thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more content like this. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. I would love to hear your feedback and opinions. See you next time.